So, Linny, Premier 15's final week. How good is that to hear? Yeah, it's uh, pretty special, isn't it? But uh, even more special being at King's Home uh, with the crowd behind us and tickets are going really well. And obviously, you were pretty confident at the start of the season that you could get make that final. You, you felt that you had a really strong squad. How satisfying is it to sort of get to that final and how hungry are you to, to get that win? Yeah, look, the girls are really hungry and I totally agree. You know, we... Over the summer, we did a real good recruitment drive and um, the game plan that we had in place to get us into that top four. Um, we knew then we won, got that top of the league, which gives us home semi-final. It's, uh, the girls are really hungry and, like I said, playing at King's Home in uh, front of the Gloucester crowd is going to be special. And has this week been about, yes, working hard, obviously, going into that final, but also about enjoying the experience and enjoying being part of that, that final preparation? Oh, definitely, you know, and I said it after the semi-final, what the girls are creating uh, in, the, in the local area for women's rugby is, is special. Um, but yeah, this, this week has just been about making sure that we just tighten up a, a few things, but also we know the threats that Exeter Chiefs have got um, and how we're going to nullify what the threats that they have. And obviously the way the girls have been playing, the way they all get on with each other, it's worked throughout the whole competition so far, so you don't want to sort of shy away from that going into the final. No, definitely, you know, it's, it's who we are. Um, it's it's the, way we, the way we play um, in attack, you know, and we, we were really attack focused last night in training and uh, there was some sharp play out there, but we take a massive pride in our defence and we know we're going to be challenged on Saturday we're facing Exeter, but we're really excited for it. Yeah, you mentioned the defence there. The defensive shift in the semi-final was obviously outstanding. And with a team of Exeter's calibre up against this weekend, it's going to be equally as important, isn't it? Oh, definitely. You know, and um, that's something that Reese Oakley has really been focusing on. Uh, we were defence focused on Monday, with defence focused tomorrow night on, on on that about looking at Exeter. And um, but the, the the girls just really relish our defence and getting that line speed and putting big hits in and, and try and get that transition into attack for then. And on the opposite side of that then, how important is it to sort of get the attack firing and get this King's Home crowd on their feet? Uh, it's massive, you know, and uh, I'm pretty sure if that shed is uh, chanting that Gloucester chant, then the girls will def definitely, you know, give something back to the, uh, the Gloucester crowd. And obviously in round one, Gloucester Hartbury defeated Exeter. I think a try inside the first two minutes it sort of set the tone for, for the game and the season. It was a long, a long way away, but sort of how much are you looking forward to facing them again? Yeah, we're always excited when we play, face uh, Exeter, you know, and uh, I totally agree. That was seven months ago where we played Exeter and um, in that first league game and it set us good, good momentum. But look, it's knockout rugby. They beat us three weeks ago. That doesn't mean anything in league rugby. It's about this 80 minutes on Saturday in a cup final. That's what counts. How proud are you of the group for getting to the final? And what will it mean to them to, to get their hands on that trophy come Saturday afternoon? Oh, very proud, you know, and um, the, the amount of effort that the players, the staff, the whole squad has put in all season. Um, it's been a massive squad effort alongside the amount of effort all the staff have been putting in to this. And this is what it's about, going out. Uh, on Allianz Premiership final day and uh, we're very lucky to be playing it at Kingsome.